Three dogs defeat to Partick Thistle this afternoon. What did you make of the day defence? Disappointed. Um, obviously losing a goal early again. It's um, really disappointing for a set piece. Um, I don't know if we were a little bit lucky or not to look it back, but this was a, a better team first half. But I think the longer that, that we grew, we got a bit more into it first half. Um, obviously, both players getting sent off as well, and I thought it probably suited us for a little bit. I thought we, we controlled the game for, for periods in. Second half, we go out and we're, we're trying to push forward. Um, they bring good good subs on, I suppose you want to call it that, and, and take their chances when they come. So, look, no complaints on the result. Um, performance, okay in stages, but we need to be a, a little bit better than that. You made a couple of changes to your start to live and bring in Liam Campbell yeah. goals. Uh, what, what's his behind that? It's an opportunity for him. He said he's been training with us. Uh, sorry, he's been part of our squad and training well. Played a few under twenty games and done well. So, look, it's an opportunity to see him. Um, they were disappointed, but he said it's in, in the main. He, he, he did a lot of good things. So, uh, delighted for him getting his his, his debut for us. Um, another another change. Look, we're hopefully got. A fit squad back now. Um, just trying to give some guy minutes and, and just looking after one or two little niggles as well. So, so we're trying to look after them, but look in the main, just disappointed. As you said, you had uh, a couple of players back available, including Nathan Austin and Nicky Lowe. How crucial is it to have have them back available? Yeah, they did a bit of training this week, just on Thursday, so we managed to get some minutes on the pitch. Just got to take care of them. Uh, and we need them fit. I said that before, if we're fully fit squad, then it gives us good options. And, um, hopefully, as I said, leading into Christmas, so that we've got that, and hopefully the boys are, are, are stay fit. What are the talking points of the match? Was obviously the, the, the two red cards. What were your initial thoughts on the decision? I genuinely, couldn't change. I was a little bit surprised. I thought the referee liked to take his cards out and, 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 and book things. So I was a wee bit surprised it was two reds. Um, genuinely, haven't seen it, so I don't know. Joe's saying that he didn't think he did anything wrong. Snapped on him, so we need to see it back and we'll take it from that. Passive game back at Bruce Central Park next weekend as we host Peter Head. What are you and the lads going to do for that one? Yeah, no, it's a big game, told them that in there, it's a big game. Hopefully, we're going with a full squad, but position's up for grabs. Um, that full squad, the players need to, to do enough to stay in the team. Um, so, decisions are need to be made on that team, but see, look, we've still got good players that, that can help teams, so we just need to do a little bit more on both boxes at the moment, and hopefully, we'll, we'll work on that this week and, and try and do better next week. Perfect, John. Thank you. Cheers, thank you.